guys, this is Baking with Chloe, and today we're going to be baking Christmas cupcakes. You can also just make regular cupcakes, it doesn't matter. But since Christmas is coming up, then I, want, I wanted to make Christmas cupcakes for you guys and show you how to make them. So first up, get your cupcakes mix from the store and um, pour it into your bowl, all of it. After that's all in, you can put that to the side. Then you need um, three full-sized eggs and crack them and put them in the bowl. Put it to the side. Make sure you don't get any shell in it. Okay, last one. Okay, after that, you're going to need to get, um, you need one cup of water and pour that in the bowl. And you need to melt your butter for 20 or 30 seconds um, inside of, doesn't really matter what you put it in, but melt it for 20 or 30 seconds and then put it back into your bowl. off to the side and then um that's all and then you mix it and put it on medium speed on your mixer so that would be about two or one okay you can put it on one at first and then turn it to two and make sure you hold your bowl tight. I've made that mistake before. I'm gonna turn it to two. Let me turn it off. gonna get some of the flour that's up on the side and then keep mixing Make sure it's mixed very, very, very well that it's very creamy and looks like batter. I turned it up to three. Okay, it looks pretty much done. Um, I'll show you guys what it looks like. And if yours doesn't look like this, you can pause the video and keep mixing till it looks like this. So it needs to look just like this. Um, then you need to um, get your cupcake holders. Well, yeah, your cupcake pan. So it's here. 
Um, um, and pour it in. And, um, get it. I'll be right back. I'm going to get my stuff nice and ready. Okay, I got all my stuff ready. We're going to move some stuff out of the way. I was moving a few of the big things. And um, now you can pour, you get a big spoon or a little spoon. I think it's more effective with a big spoon. but And pour it in. So it's pretty, so it's like filled to the top. And just like that. And I'm gonna put that in the bowl and I'm just gonna move the camera. Okay, now I move the camera. We're going to get some more of the batter. Okay. Okay. And then you pour it in another one. You can taste the batter. If you don't like how it tastes, then you can add more of something. Okay. Okay. Um, so since I showed you how to do it, I'm going to get the rest of them done. I'll be right back. Okay, and now I have all my cupcakes done. I have this pan right here. This is um, the silver one pan. And then my other pan that I showed you guys at first. Let me go get it. Right here. We have the green. We have green and we have silver right here. These are all the cupcakes. Once you've filled all the ones that you want, then you can um, you prep the oven for 350 degrees. After that, you put it in there for about well, between 14 minutes and 20 minutes. And if it still doesn't look done, um, well, and if you want to check it, put a, like a, um, um, a toothpick and test it. Um, but if they look perfectly done, then yeah. If they're not done, put them in there for about five more minutes. Um, and I'm going to put them in the oven and make sure you have ribbon. I'm going to put them in the oven and then we're going to work on the icing. Okay. Okay, this is the green one. So make sure if you have any extra cupcake holder that were in the pan because you couldn't fit, you had no more um, mixed batter left. Um, 
and um, so just take them out so they don't burn. So yeah, then it might smell like fire. So yeah, um, time to put all the way in again. Nice and ready. And now we're going to click bake. Click timer on your oven. Okay. I'm going to get that ready and then we're going to start the icing. Be right back. Okay, I found the timer button. <laughs> um, do it for about 19 minutes. Okay. Okay. You have to look at the minutes in it. Okay. That's the stove. I'm going to get that set up. <laughs> Okay, sorry guys, I was having trouble finding the timer, so you click timer on, you go over here, you put 19, zero, zero, and then you click upper timer again, and you have your timer set, time to make icing. So I'm going to get all my stuff ready, and we're going to get the icing. Okay guys, now that we have um, our buttercream, so you want to get yourself some buttercream and put it um, in a bowl. And if you're um, using coloring, I'm doing some half green and half red. So if you're doing what I'm doing, you have to have a little bit of buttercream in one bowl and a little bit of buttercream in the other bowl. But you just split it in half, half of them one bowl, the other half and the other bowl and then you'll get your food coloring but if you don't want food coloring you can just yeah put it on your um put put it inside of a just put it on your cupcakes yeah and um so now we're going to put in our green food coloring inside of our buttercream okay and you can put as much as you want Okay, I'll be right back once I finish mixing all of this up. This is the finishing product of the icing. We have green, we have red. I'll come right back when we are done with the cupcakes, you guys, in just a sec. Okay, I got two cupcakes done so far. Um, and um, the whole um, cupcake pan is done. And uh, we have two cupcakes ready, our icing ready, and I'm going to get the rest of them done, but I was just showing you guys what it looks like. Um, you can use whatever that you would like to um, put it on, put the icing on, but these are my cupcakes. I have one green, and I have this one red. Um, and yeah, so I'll show you the rest of the cupcakes when I'm all done with them. So these are the two that I've done so far. Time to get the rest done. Be right back. Okay, I have one plate done. This is what it looks like. And I'm going to be on to the next one. So the pattern is green, red, green, red, green, red, green, red. And then I have one that's green and red in the middle. So this is what it looks like. Okay, time to go to the next plate. Oh, and also, you don't have to do it exactly like me. You can do it however you want. Okay, guys, I'm back with the finishing product. It took me a while. It might take you shorter. It's just, you know, I'm not a pro at cooking and stuff. But this was the final result. 
I hope you enjoyed the video and have a very great day. Enjoy your delicious cupcakes.